You know, bikes are really cool, especially in a city like Copenhagen that's designed for them. But we still use cars, and the problem is, on average, every car puts about 17,000 pounds of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere every year. And it's an invisible gas. I mean, maybe if cars spat out bricks of carbon, we'd pay more attention. And actually, that's kind of what used to happen. In New York, at the turn of the 20th century, horses left behind about two and a half million pounds of manure in the streets every day. Around the same time, um, there was a study in London that suggested that within 50 years, the entire city would be buried in nine feet of horse manure. Well, of course, that didn't happen because of new technologies. And that's exactly what we need today. We have to have a kind of zero emission form of mobility. And whether the source of the fuel and power is hydrogen or clean electricity, we simply have to move to a world where our form of transportation no longer puts carbon dioxide into the atmosphere.